It's the Friday special. I need to know. Wow. Hello everybody. Welcome back to a new vlog. Though October is over, the vlogs are not. I'm carrying on kind of as we have been throughout November just because things were a little bit slack in October and it's like, why not carry on? So yeah, we are back. Um, today it is Friday. We've had a bit of a week. We had Halloween and stuff, so thing a lot for that. Lots of sweet treats, lots of everything. Had new flowers. I think I might have actually vlogged that. I vlogged picking up my pumpkin, which is here, and it's now looking a little bit worse for wear. Oh, insert like a little clip over the top. And like the amount of times like I've been out there. I really hope my camera picked that up. Stunning. What is that? Is that a bubble? So. Oh, those are cute. My pumpkin is here. Look at it. Look at you guys. It's so pretty. There's very few things that I make that squeaky noise for, but a floral pumpkin will be one of them. Oh, I just love it so much. So yeah, that is my little Halloween floral sitch. I'm literally ready to go to the gym, but I'm just like, <laughs> I look horrendous, <laughs> please ignore. But I just wanna show you all my flowers. So I've also got these in here, which looks so pretty. Just thought I'd show you all of my flowers before I forget. But yeah, these are so gorgeous. So yeah, nice little Halloween munch in here. Vases from Zara Home, I picked that up the other day. I think I vlogged that. Uh, basically, I thought I had a vase big enough here and it turns out it got destroyed by the dishwasher. So um, yeah, I had to run out and get another one. This one's so pretty. It's like a very dark, dark, dark blue, but it kind of looks black. So works nicely in here. Love it. I've got a stool in here. I'll talk about that a little bit later, I think. Um, actually, I'll talk about it now because otherwise I'll forget. This is from Ikea. My friend Carla recommended this and also these, which are little, air freshener thingies which keep all your clothes smelling nice They're, that's meant to be in the wardrobe but I kind of put it there because it looks cute and it's also making this room smell great but yeah I got this stool um, because I actually can't reach like really high up on these cupboards and in my wardrobes they're even higher so I can never put my bedding away and stuff and she recommended this just for like wardrobes in general but it works especially well for me because I'm so small so yeah I picked this up from Ikea it looks really cute in here looks really cute anywhere to be honest uh so super happy she also recommends these I'm gonna do a full blog post on like things that are handy to have in your wardrobe to keep it all neat and tidy because they think that would be really really helpful for some of you uh because I have some of my own tips and then there's some tips that I learned so yeah but super happy with that it's looking really cute in here I'm not going to show you the other side of the room because it looks like actual trash but yeah really happy oh it's very rare I'm happy with a room but yeah and then how cute these are my flowers I got the other day and I thought they'd actually look really nice here so yeah that's what you see when you come in super cute I don't think I've ever showed you this little bit here I've got pics of me and all my friends these are some really old pictures this frame obviously I don't see it like I see it when I walk in but I don't linger here so I don't put like my favorite pics lots of me and the twins <laughs> and then there's Jess and Manal Lucy Tazzy and Stevie oh that's going blurry and Edie my goddaughter in the fro yeah I love this frame it's really cute and there's me and Lucy, drunk on a Tuesday. Standard. Oh, I love it. it. Makes me so happy. Right, now I'm actually off to the gym. Be right back. I'll see you when I don't look like a potato anymore. Yeah. She's always on high alert. She's always scared. Cheese? Cheese? Treat? <sighs> no, nothing. Huh? Literally nothing. Yeah. <laughs> 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 
the resemblance is uncanny. <laughs> We did lots of prep for Halloween, had loads and loads of sweet treats, had a really nice evening last night with lots of Greek food and then just like loads and loads and loads of ice cream and cake and it was amazing. And yeah, I've just been filming videos and I've got a bag collection which is about a million years long. Like you all have aged a decade by the time you finish watching it. So that's not up already, it's coming and I hope you guys enjoy that. Just been really miserable weather, like it's the most grim weather ever at the moment so i just haven't been really up to much apart from just kind of like pottering and there's only so much pottering i feel like i can vlog i had some new deliveries arrive today so i thought i would show you what i got had some sneaky shopping time yesterday which lauren had a slight outburst over. yes it was sneaky <laughs> very sneaky it's like oh, i've just been buying some things and lauren's like sneaky <laughs> <laughs> so I have to announce all purchases from now on as I'm purchasing. But yeah, I'm going to show you what I picked up because I picked up some new things from Zara. There's just a lot of stuff on the new in section that I was really, really into. So I was like, well, I'm just going to pick those up and try them on and I'll send them back. And other lies I tell myself. And then I also ordered a couple of pairs of shoes which I saw which I fell in love with. So very excited to unbox those. Also, my skin today. Ignore the two giant craters on it because I don't know what my new friends are doing on my face, but look at that glow. That's nice. I'm wearing the Bare Minerals Complexion Rescue foundation sticks. So I'll show you those if you haven't seen them already. I actually love these. So basically, I love the Complexion Rescue range. Then they brought out the foundation sticks and I kind of said to them in advance, like when these come out, like I'm, I'm doing some kind of content on them like i need to i need to be involved in this i absolutely love this range i'm so ready got it tried it loved it we did a video on it so previous partner but still love it use this today it's like they're quite non-clogging so i just find them really good for especially when i'm like quite breakout prone like i am at the moment at this time of the month which is basically half the bloody month but yeah i just find they give the best glow they're really non-clogging they allow your skin to breathe but they're just such good coverage and such a nice glow all at the same time love it look a bit disheveled still because uh just been out to get some food and some coffee because i ran out of milk just really on top of life at the moment it's really getting dark let it be light so i'm gonna just unwrap myself and i'll be back with you to show you what i picked up really gloomy in here i wish i had one of those like flats where it didn't look gloomy all the time you know some people have like really beautiful youtube videos where their house just looks really bright and cute all the time mine does not this room is like a weird shape so half of it gets light half of it doesn't anyway it's time to open my deliveries i actually have more coming so you might see more in another vlog or later in this one okay so these first two items i actually saw on hannah krosky's instagram i've known hannah for years and years She's really cute and her instagram is great so if you don't follow her i would definitely recommend it she did some work with june and she mentioned these shoes and you know i'm a sucker for anything i see anyone wear on instagram so loved these i love a square toe these are just exactly what i needed in my wardrobe like i have one pair of nude shoes i believe and not even that many black ones that are like appropriate for daytime and i'm really loving wearing heels at the moment so i just thought these were perfect but anyway these are little square toed really simple sandals i'm super excited to try these on oh my god they're gonna look so cute then i also picked them up in this color 
The black are very much more classic. I ordered the two colours, but I may send these back. I'm not 100%. I definitely wanted the nude, but I thought I'd try both of them on and see kind of how they work into my wardrobe. They're just so beautiful, so simple, a really nice, clean, minimal cut. Yeah, I really love them. So I'm going to try those on in a second. Then I have the classic pop on to Zara to order one single thing and end up coming away with loads of other stuff. So yeah, I thought I'd show you. Might as well. I don't know if I'll keep it all. Some of it was new stuff I wanted to try to see if I would recommend it. So they've got new bodies in, for example, with a high neck. I don't know how much I love high neck, but I'm quite interested to try them on, have a play with them, see if I would recommend them to you guys. But yeah, not 100%. So I thought what's the harm in ordering it and having a little kind of like wear of it seeing if I'd recommend it for you guys on stories or in the vlog and I've got these trousers which are like a grey camel colour I've really been looking for something like this that I can pair with like a warmer brown belt and like maybe a white t-shirt I'm really hoping these fit well on the leg because they feel beautiful yeah and I don't have a pair of new trousers and I really felt like that was missing so very excited for those I've got a pair of skinny leather trousers because i am just finding at the moment there's i've got the leggings and i've got like more smart trousers in addition to my joggers and then i just feel like there's a skinny element that is really missing and with the shoes that i wear i just feel like a skinny pair would work out the best so let's see how i get on with that I might end up sending it back so i'm fully prepared for it not to work out then i also purchased these like long sleeve t-shirts i just thought they'd be a great basic got them in two colors where's the other color been? here it is this one is more of a like taupey color i thought they'd be really nice tucked i think they look quite basic just like this but yeah i thought they'd be beautiful tucked so we shall see and then i also picked up this ring which i just think is so cute it's got like a kind of three rings like woven element to it and it's quite chunky i just thought it was really cute and just fancied a new ring so i thought i'd pick that up we have the black high neck body super cute a hat is starting to get to that time of year where i feel like i am gonna need a hat i don't get on super well with hats so i just wanted something really simple sorry my hair is like stuck to my piercings i just wanted something really really simple that would kind of get me through the winter i don't really know i always feel like i look like a little smurf with uh, hats on so i'm not sure if I'm honest, I don't really know. How do you even wear beanies anymore? Like, yeah, I don't really know. Hmm. <laughs> I'm, I'm not entirely sure. I mean, hats, like, just don't, we don't get on. Really botched my hair now. I mean, it didn't look that good in the first place, but you know oh and then we have the other pair of skinny trousers i basically ordered them in a small and a medium to see which size because what i really don't want is to have them in a small and then be just that little bit too tight where they don't look good and i didn't want a medium because quite often zara mediums on me are quite big around the waist which is great for if you want to go out for dinner but if it's a skinny look jean and they're too big they're just going to look ridiculous but it could be that the medium actually just has that kind of more slightly more roomy effect on the legs and actually fits well around the hips i don't know so yeah i'm just gonna see which one kind of fits better but yeah those are the things that i picked up so i'll insert a little cutaway section for this video now and i'm gonna go fix my hair so these are the trousers they are a little bit long so i've had to roll them up i'm hoping they will stay up during this little test run and if they do then all good I really like them they're really really cute love this body i actually think i am converted to the high necks i think they're going to be a great staple for winter this one's really cute got a small again like i did with my other ones they fit really really well just so beautiful so very very happy with this okay this is the white long sleeves top i really really like these they're just super comfy oversized i'm pretty sure i got these in a small i will clarify in the info box but i'm pretty sure i went for a small if not I, then i went for a medium and that's why it's a little bit baggier but i love them i like the fact that the sleeves kind of cover your hand i don't know why the child in me loves that and yeah they just fit really beautifully they're also kind of half they've got like a cut so it splits either side of your thigh which i think can be very flattering also really helps for tucking in i just found it was really really easy to tuck and it's kind of done a messy kind of vibe i really like it these trousers are great. I went for the medium in the end. They definitely run very, very small. Normally a medium has like a lot of room for food and these are like perfect fit. So I would say they run small. So size up 
if in doubt yeah love these they're super cute really like the material of them they don't feel too like snug they aren't a leather feel on the inside they have a kind of lining and it just feels very soft and really really comfortable so very very happy with these i've paired them with my boots just so you can see because i know i talked about that i think these would actually look amazing with a pair of tan boots and then a tan bag as well maybe the same jumper i think that would look really cute so yeah i think these are going to be a winner and you're going to see me living in these over the winter autumn winter months so i thought i'd show you the other long sleeve top untucked i know lots of you will prefer to have this top untucked like i know i look at this and i'm like my mom would live for this color and she would definitely wear this untucked she wouldn't tuck it into her and she loves a leather legging as well we are the same person but yeah i can imagine her wearing this and wearing it not tucked so i thought i would show you that as another option because you've already seen the white one tucked in so you know but that's kind of what it looks like with the split on the side very very cute really i love these i think they're a great wardrobe basic and so good for the winter like i love wearing a t-shirt with my leggings but going into winter that's just not going to be a possibility so these are going to be amazing they're also great for like lounging in as well so a really great versatile t-shirt and i definitely think i'll get so much wear out of these i just love this color as well it's really really beautiful just a lovely taupey colour. Goes really well with my makeup. Like, this is the kind of makeup colour that I wear. Basically, I just want clothes that match my makeup. Morning, everybody. Today it is Saturday. I've had the world's longest sleep, so I'm feeling pretty good right now. But I've just been filming the cutaways for the Zara clips, which you will have already seen. So lucky you. You get to know how this video turned out. I don't right now. I am obsessed with the long sleeve t-shirts. I didn't think I would be this obsessed with something so plain, but my god i'm gonna live in these look at this it looks so cute with these trousers i love that i'm showing you this i haven't even finished doing all the cutaways yet and i'm just like hi oh, yeah look and you've already seen it so i won't bore you too much but yeah i just really love this look i feel like i've become very very comfortable in like a very simple kind of minimal ish outfit and then heels like whether it's boots or an actual pair of like sandaled heels like, i don't care about the weather i don't care that it's not summer i love wearing like a heel at the moment it just makes me feel so good like one very simple switch to my wardrobe and i don't mind wearing heels all the time so yeah this is very much my comfort zone at the moment i don't really want to take this off today but i do actually have to go to the gym i've done my two rest days and now it's like you know you do your rest days too early in the week and then you know the rest of the week and your weekend are like you can't skip it so yeah, and I've eaten way too much pizza to be skipping it. I'm so full of pizza. I don't want to get changed out of this, but I will have to. Um, I also rediscovered a pair of sunglasses that I am loving. Where are they? Here they are. These ones from Celine. Ryan actually picked these for me at the airport. I wanted a pair of sunglasses and couldn't decide, and he picked these ones. And I tried them on this morning because I wanted to make a joke about trying to be Rosie Huntington Whiteley because I feel like that is everybody's aim at the moment, including mine. And I put them on with this outfit and I was like, yeah, okay, this is me for the day now, even though I have to go to the gym. So I've fallen back in love with these, expect to see them a lot. I will try and link them if I can, but I got them at the airport and I always find the discontinued stuff is always at the airport. So yeah, not 100% on whether I'll be able to find these, but highly recommend if you can get your hands on these. They're super cute, love them. Also, this is how far I got with my breakfast this morning. How bad is that? Really not great. I don't do well when we don't have almond milk in the flat. Yeah, I also have been trying out the new iPhone. It has like a wide camera mode and I'm just obsessed with it. I don't know if I can show you on here. This is like normal camera mode. And then God, trying to do vlogging and camera stuff at the same time. Impossible. Oh, look. Look at that. Look at my leg. That is ridiculous. I will never use this to try and make my legs longer. It's really cute. Like, it's not ideal because it means you can see all the shit that's in my lounge that I hide from you guys normally. But it's quite cute for like a little kind of picture. I'll insert one now. I'm kind of obsessed with that. I would love your recommendations for cases though. I need to do that. And I don't really know, apart from Apple, where at the moment we'll be doing good iPhone 11 Pro Max cases because it's kind of like still quite new so let me know where if you've got one where your favorite place was that you've bought one from and how the case is holding up i don't particularly care about it being super like bounce proof because i actually very rarely drop my phone i only dropped my phone twice last year and it just so happened to be like the worst drops in the world one onto my car seat and it bounced out the car and then one onto some ice 
in Iceland and uh, it just shattered the entire screen. But yeah, apart from that in my life, I've never dropped a phone. So I'm not too worried about it being like incredibly bounce proof, but something very cute ideally i don't know nothing mirrored though i've decided i love the look of a mirrored phone but i would constantly be cleaning it and that would drive me mad so yeah recommendations anyway in the comments below please well that was good i remember to vlog that hold on me 10 points <laughs> it was really good yeah, I never want to eat ever again. Ever. So cold! <laughs> we should have eaten outside. Mm -hmm. oh. It's crazy. Oh my god, it's so cold. before it gets about a million years long because uh, I want to try and keep these below 30 minutes for a short while so I thought I would come on here and say thank you very much for watching sorry this vlog was a bit of a muddle I had a lot of footage that was kind of left over and I didn't want you to miss out on it and just like throw it away so I've kind of just tried to cram as much as I could into this week's vlog but I hope you guys have enjoyed it regardless and yeah I will see you guys next week hopefully for another vlog oh also, I uploaded my bag collection and I'm not sure it went in sub boxes, so bag collection is live and I know lots of you requested it. So yeah, I will link to that in the info box, not the comment section, as I was literally just about to say. So yeah, I will link to that uh, if you would like to go and watch it, that'd be fun. And I'll see you guys again very, very soon. Bye. P.S. Next video is a what I wore in a week. Be there.